Welcome back to our channel. We're Matt and Shelby, and we've been traveling for a while now and sharing our adventures on here. Check out our other videos, like last week when we toured Croatia's beautiful and mysterious Lokrum Island. We're still in Dubrovnik, Croatia, and we've been here for a while. We're getting a little stir crazy. So we decided to take a little day trip today and go to the city of, it looks like Kavtat, but I've heard that in Croatian it's pronounced Tsavtat. For anyone concerned about Matt's eye, don't worry, it was just a mosquito bite, and that guy was promptly squished. So we're gonna go hop on a ferry at the main harbor in the old city of Dubrovnik, and it should take about 45 minutes, and then we'll show you around Tsavtat. We're done with our quick jaunt on the ferry. It was pretty chilly. Yeah, it was chilly because um, it was open, all the windows. And... Still really nice. Oh, there's another one. Oh, on a motorcycle. Anyway, we're now in Savtat and we're just gonna walk around and see what we can see. First impressions. Very pretty. Look at how clear the water is. Well, we circumnavigated that peninsula. <laughs> Basically, the way that Savtat is located, it's like kind of almost a big, like W shape, sort of. I don't know. Like there's these big parts that jet into the water and. There's this really pretty walkway that goes along the whole thing and it's pretty shaded too so you can walk even if it's really sunny. There's some beaches along the way. It's really nice. It doesn't seem like there's a lot going on. What a nice face to greet you. This place is uh, a little eerie feeling. I don't know if it's just the day we're here. I hope it's not. I think it's not the day we're here. I think like most of the stuff is closed. Like this clearly used to be like a very busy area to we're go. I'm saying like there's so many hotels and restaurants here, but a lot of them seem closed. Yeah. And I wonder if maybe it was from COVID if they just weren't able to stay open. I don't know. I it's like when part I was of looking it. online, it said that this place is really popular and happening, but maybe that was like an article I was written before pandemic or something. For some reason it didn't occur to us at the time that the town also may have just been closed down for tourist season. The weather was just so nice we figured people must still be vacationing here. Oh, we got some scuba diving, diving school, banana. <laughs> Thanks for catching that. Random ATMs, like there is infrastructure here, but then there's like no tables and chairs. Just very bizarre. There's a chalkboard, but then there's like clearly no liquor. This place is strange. There's more research we need to do. Two more ATMs. Hello, can we please buy? Oh, can we please buy two? No one's working here. Looks like clearly this is a restaurant at some point. We are uh, back in civilization. 
Shelby just saw something that she really wants. She It was like a sign that said massage. Well, it was like chocolate. a spa sign and it had all different, you know, like body massages and peels and things. And then there was just those things that said chocolate. I want to know, that raises more questions than answers. I want to know, do I eat the chocolate while I get massaged or do they put chocolate on me as some sort of beauty treatment? I have questions. Isn't it good for your skin? I don't know. Do you know? I, <laughs> Can someone tell me? Let us know in the comments. I don't know. Do you put chocolate on your skin? <laughs> we find ourselves growing up many steps to reach a family mausoleum. What is this place? <laughs> peaceful and quiet here but it does make you think like there's like societal shifts almost in the way that people think about where what to use for this type of space like look at this view behind us it's like insane and to think that it's like a grave site like a cemetery like it definitely would never be something like that today it would be something like a really cool restaurant or something to like make more money. But it's just interesting to think about like what society maybe used to value and maybe I'm just making this up, but they used to value like where the dead would be laid to rest, like in this very beautiful location, like a place to come and um, see your loved ones and also like think about how you're gonna die someday. So, Think about that. Well, now that we've thought about our mortality, it's time to get some pizza. I'm getting a camembert pizza, which is, camembert is kind of like brie cheese. It's um, slightly different, but it has mozzarella, camembert, olives, which we're mixing, and garlic and olive oil. And I am trying what I think is a Croatian beer. <laughs> Those olives off of there. No, thank you. Stringy. I like it with the camembert. That's interesting. We got a tasty meal in our bellies. Yeah, that was fine. <laughs> <laughs> now we're gonna head over to the ferry to take us back to Dubrovnik. That concludes our excursion to Tsaptat. What did you think? Uh, unique. Yeah. Worth coming. Yeah, unique, I guess. There's something different, you know? Yes. What did you guys think? <laughs> yeah. Let us know below. If you stuck through this video, respect. <laughs> respect? Yeah, don't forget to. Or sad, uh, like, you should do something more. We with have life. <laughs> many interesting. Yes, I promise your other videos might be more interesting than Yeah, you videos. might want to check, check those out. out. <laughs> Join us on our next adventure. We're on island time again. Come with us in our next video to explore Croatia's gorgeous beachy island of Lopin. We'll see you next time.